Tonight we decide to look for bananas hard around the rice fields. <laughs> After that, we peel off the outer layer and then cook it. Like the Asians say, food doesn't feel right without rice. Fish. Almost every day we always eat fish. However, somehow we never get tired of eating fish. Besides fish is easy to get, cooking like this can be a beautiful memory for us in the future. This is Wuwu. After a few days left in the river, we went to check it out and found some big fish. But because we didn't know how to cook this fish, we released it back into the river. As usual, we cook the fish we hunt in a simple way. Even so, it still tastes good. Today we go to look for river clam. In just a short time, we found a lot of them. So that it can be consumed, we need to boil it and take the poisonous part. After that, mix the clam meat with bananas hot and the spices that have been prepared. Breakfast is finally ready to eat. This kid is stealing cassava from my grandfather's garden. He chose a plant with a large cassava inside the ground. What annoyed me, he didn't really mean to cook it. As a result, the cassava wasn't fully cooked. It's a shame to waste food like this. So today's menu is grilled fish and also grilled rice. The thing that I hate the most when cooking with firewood is the smoke. But when the food is cooked, all of our hard work will pay off. Delicious. So today we go to the dam to swim. But unfortunately, the river below the dam receded. So now we can only lie down between the rocks like a corpse. And maybe come again tomorrow when dam is open. Really disappointed that day by you. What you guys doing on Saturday night? Go to the field and cook fish like us? Or well, whatever it is, don't forget to stay grateful and make yourself happy. Don't wait for others to do something. Because not everyone cares about you. My pet died. Instead of wasting them, I'd rather cook my dead pets. May you rest in peace in my belly. Okay, now let's do my little pasang. So today we go to feast at the dam which is still under construction. Look at that person. I hope Godzilla doesn't bite his leg. After tracing the rocky river, the number of fish we get really tickles my nose. They can even make the worm in my stomach happy. Did you know that coconut can also be served hot? How good does it taste? Let's find out. Okay, screw this. I use an easier way. Don't forget to add pure honey. Hmm, so when I was little, I loved fishing. When I got fish, I didn't cook it in the simplest way possible. That was one of the beautiful memories in my life. The villagers here also like fishing, but too lazy to cook the fish. 
So I cook the fish and share it with the other kids. Even though the fish are small, but it reminds me. I was told that one of the village children caught a big fish and wanted to cook it together. So we went looking for spinach leaf to make as an additional menu. There is also leftover rice which we can make fried rice. I have a dream to cook tons of food in every place I visit and make people smile. But for now, I only able to cook for couple kids because I'm hella broke. <laughs>